Is this a comic book version of a presidential no, campaign? A comic the Sun Sentinel says Rubio should resign, not rip us off. When they say you act like you hate your job, do you? Do you hate your job? You've had issues. You have a lack of bookkeeping skills. Is that why you're having a difficult time in this room? Does that not speak to your vetting process or judgment in any way? The questions that have been asked so far in this debate illustrate why the American people don't trust the media. This is not a cage match. Donald Trump, are you a comic book villain? Ben Carson, can you do math? John Kasich, will you insult two people over here? Marco Rubio, why don't you resign? Jeb Bush, why have your numbers fallen? How about talking about the substantive issues people care about? It did the best of anything that I have tested since I started doing debate testing in 1996. And, and Carl, Carl, I'm not finished yet. The contrast with the Democratic debate, where every fawning question from the media was, which of you is more handsome and wise? The men and women on this stage have more ideas, more experience, more common sense than every participant in the Democratic debate. That debate reflected a debate between the Bolsheviks and the Mensheviks.